Hey, welcome back. Today we're at a pretty unique place. Today, behind the gates of the Aurora Cemetery in Ontario, Canada, is this 1868 dead house. I have never seen inside before. So today I got special permission from Sydney and Shane. They work here at the cemetery in Aurora. They open it up for me to take a tour inside. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. Let's go take a look. In the winter months, they used to store the human remains inside until the ground thawed in the spring. So it hasn't been open in quite some time. They do, they do have a bit of stuff inside, but they used to keep caskets inside and the human remains inside. This building actually used to be all brick and you could see they put stucco over top. I'm hoping once we get inside, we'll be able to see the brick from the inside. It hasn't been opened up. It's not open to the public. I got special permission to come inside here today. But you can see this door here. I'm assuming it is original to this building. It probably has quite a few coats of paint on top over the years. This dead house was built in 1868 by a local builder named Henry Harris for Charles Doan, the president of the Aurora Cemetery Company. Wow, it's actually quite large in here. It looks quite small, but once you're inside here, it's pretty large. I'm not too sure what these ledges are for, but yeah, these to uh, keep some shelves in here, uh, they used to have store some caskets inside. They used to keep the, the human remains in here. Oh yeah, you can see the brick here. It looks like they covered it with some kind of plaster just to preserve it. These structures go by a few names. Some call them dead houses, receiving tombs, moored houses, or a cemetery vault. I don't know what that is there. I'm not too, sh too sure if that was used to hoist the human remains up on the shelf or the caskets. I'll have to find out what that's for. But yeah, they only kept the, the human remains inside here during the winter months, just until the ground thawed and then they were able to do the burials. This dead house building is shaped as an octagon and it's pretty rare nowadays. This is one of five known octagon shaped cemetery vaults in Ontario, Canada. 